Hello, again I created circuit using this method. These uh, circuits are sometimes called uh, freeform circuits, cir circuit sculpture, 3D circuits or even uh, naked circuits. When my last freeform circuits was published, uh, people wanted to know how to make this cube uh, format frame. In my last projects frames were soldered and they were pretty messy. But a couple of uh, days ago I got an idea how to make a frame that looks better and it is easier to make than this soldered. In this video I will show you how to make this frame using components that you probably have at home. I will also show you how to build this one push button Arduino project that can be a stopwatch, flappy bird game or evil eye of Sauron that forgets to blink. Yes, I know that this is not most useful project, but it is fun. Before we start, I just want to thank my subscribers for support. In a couple of days I will reach 4000 subscribers. Thank you very much, I am very happy because of that. And if you are not my subscriber, feel free to check my channel. Maybe you can find something interesting for you and make my subscriber number even higher. Let's start. First I will cut two 7 cm long wires and two 5 cm long wires. Then I will take these terminal block connectors, I will remove screws and I will need to remove this plastic because I only need this metal connector part. I will also need screws later. I will need many of them, so I prepared 10 pieces using safe method. Using this tool I will make screw threads on uh, both sides of this 5 cm long wire. And now I can on easy way make this frame. Later I added these three additional metal connectors so I can use them for legs and push button. I will cu cut uh, two more pieces of wire, 5 cm long, and I will make screw threads but only on one side. Uh, these two pieces will be legs for, for frame, I don't know. And here is simple frame that will hold our... I think it looks great. Now let's make circuit. Usually I use this bigger OLED which is quite common for Arduino projects but now I decided to use this smaller OLED. I will also use the smallest Arduino I have. It is Arduino Pro Mini. It is smaller than Arduino Nano and it will fit my frame very nicely. Arduino Pro Mini is little harder to program, so I will use Arduino Uno to program it. Check links in the description if you want to know how to program Pro Mini with Arduino Uno.
Let's connect components. First I will remove those legs. I will solder this push button. Any type of push button can be used. Now I will solder this switch. OLED display communicate uh, using I2C protocol. I need to solder a serial clock pin on Arduino which is A5 to serial clock on OLED. Also I need to solder pin A4 which is serial data to serial data pin on OLED. Remaining two pins are ground and VCC. I will solder wire to each of them. I will solder this connector to my switch. I will also solder wire to ground of Arduino Pro Mini. And wire to pin 3. That pin will be connected to push button. All ground pins will be soldered directly to frame. I will solder VCC pins from Arduino and OLED uh, display directly to this connector. And this device is finished. In the description of this video you can find code for stopwatch, flappy bird or for evil eye. Also I will um, put their uh, schematic and part list. Thank you for your time. I hope that this video will give you nice ideas for your future projects. If you like my ideas feel free to subscribe for more awesome projects. Have a nice day.